This video is to show you how to open up one of these Humvee smart start boxes or EESS box, which is what this one is. This one is not an actual smart box. This is just your start system box, your glow plug controller, and it controls a couple other things. These go bad. They burn out your glow plugs or, or other issues. Um, you probably want to start by washing the damn thing off, or at least wiping it off. This one was covered in dirt from years of being up under that dash. Um, I wouldn't get water all inside these plugs, so I'd just wipe it off or something like that. Next, you want to take all these screws out. These screws go all the way around the perimeter. The one that goes here above this cannon plug is a screw with a little nut. You can unscrew it and hold the nut with your finger. It's not a big deal. The next thing is these are sealed. So you want to take a screwdriver. It's got a relatively thin blade. And what I did was I flipped this up on end and I pushed the screwdriver blade carefully in here and just twist it a little bit. And the first spot I did, you heard the seal break and it was like a vacuum suction because it's been sealed for a long time. And then I just kept doing that slowly and carefully along until it popped itself enough to where I could just grab it and it just flipped open like this. You don't want to damage the seal basically. So now that you're inside the box, <clears throat> here's what the inside of the box looks like. Um, from research online, it looks like usually they're, these are burned out usually, and the ones in this box will find, and usually there's a burned spot on the board somewhere, or this 24 volt solenoid is going bad. So, I'm not seeing any burn spot in here on the board. That doesn't mean one of these components isn't burned out, but they don't look burned out or damaged. So, it may just be that the contacts inside the solenoid went bad. I never tried this box. This box is supposed to be no good. Uh, maybe the guy was wrong and however he was testing it or whatever he was doing with it maybe he had it hooked to a wrong TSU I don't know but that's the inside of your box that's how you open it up um, I may put this back together throw it in my truck and see if it works um, the other thing to do is I need to get a box that does work because I just put in a glow plugs and my smart start box that's a Nartron also just cooked within three starts cooked all my brand new spark plugs so if nothing else I may do what I saw in another video and disconnect the board from the solenoid or probably this trigger wire is all I need to disconnect and just cap it off and then take power from whichever is the hot side coming in from the battery on here and drill a hole in the bottom run a wire out and put a plunger switch on the dash and then run a wire back in from that plunger switch to this so I can manually activate the uh, the solenoid because if the rest of this is all working, then the only issue is the solenoid here. So if the solenoid itself is bad, you could buy another solenoid. It's just a small 24 volt solenoid. But if you don't want to go through all this, all this again, you can just make it so you can manually trigger the solenoid. The other option I've seen in military trucks is they actually take a 24 volts they just they bypass the ability for this to do anything your glow plugs you pull the dog box out 
you unplug the glow plug harnesses from the harness that runs back to this. You mount a 24 volt solenoid on the firewall somewhere. You get power to it from the battery. And then the other side of this gets hooked to the two harnesses for the glow plugs. And then all you have to do again is put a switch on your dash. One of those push plunger start switches that as soon as you let off the switch pops back out on its own. Um, to activate this right here and it turns this, it'll turn your solenoid on. So those are the options. Or you could go spend a small fortune by another box. So hope this helps somebody. At least it shows you how to get in a box and what's inside the box on this particular style unit.